So there we have it, two eels. They'll go on the smoker tomorrow. Now if I was a young Māori fella and that was my first eel, I'd uh, cook it over an open fire, a sacred fire, and share it with the rest of my tribe. But uh, seeing as those aren't my two first eels, I'm going to take them home and put them in my homemade smoker and give them to family and friends and put a little bit in the freezer for Christmas dinner. So the two methods of catching eels I used tonight, one was toy which was bobbing with a bit of carnauka and some flax and the other one was the good old spear. But I do quite like a bit of eel catching. Yeti, so here we have a big stout carnauka pole or a tea tree pole as they know of it in Australia, but seeing as we're not in Australia, we'll call it Karnuka. Got a bit of flax here, so come on up and I'll show you how to make this thing. First of all, we tie a knot in the flax. Tie it really tight, right there. And then, we grab the end of the stick. Nice, and then we go to the other end of the flax. We tie a knot in here. Africa, can you do a nice and tight? Africa, and then can you do up. a video of me trying to find my planet? We sure can. What yeah. planet do you live on? Ross. Planet Ross. <laughs> Sounds <laughs> like an awesome planet. Yeah, we're just in Africa. Sweet. All right. <laughs> After we tie the knot in the flax, we're just gonna. Make it really stringy in all these bits and then pound it on a rock. Now you can see here, I'll give you a close up. See all these little fibers in the flax plant? What happens is the eel comes and grabs onto the worms that are tied up in here or bits of meat or uh, whatever you want to use to use as eel bait and then their teeth get stuck on these fibers. They start to spin like a crocodile and we grab this end and just rah, lob them out onto the bank. Oh, good technique, Jack. Nice. So we've got a mixture in here, we've got some sea salt, some pepper, some dark Madeira cane sugar, some lemon zest, and we're just going to add some rosemary to it, and then pound all that up. <laughs> no, it's actually really good. <laughs> I was just kidding. <laughs> mm.